coaches, I get asked all the time, what is something that a player can do to work on their serve when they're at home? And that's why I'm going to show you the homework assignment that I give to a lot of my players, which is wall traps. Wall traps are really easy, but also very technical because they focus on three different components of a successful overhand serve. The first thing that we're gonna work on is tossing in front of our hitting arm. In my case, it's my right shoulder. So all we're gonna do is toss over to the right so it lands in front of my right shoulder. We also wanna toss so that the ball is in front of us. So as we rock forward, we need that ball to still be in front. And we also want the ball to be just a little bit higher than we can reach in our toss. That way we're building momentum and contacting the ball as we're moving forward. Keeping those three things in mind, here's what a wall trap is gonna look like. Now we're also gonna start with our arm up and ready to strike the ball. We can have it low, high. It's up to you as the coach to determine what your preference is. I don't really care as long as the arm's up. So notice that my elbow is always straight as I'm making contact and I'm hitting the ball right in the center. This is going to help me practice my float serve contact, which is best for most beginner players. Have your players do 50 to 100 a night and they'll be able to progress faster in practice. Having your players practice volleyball at home is going to allow you to move forward faster in practice. And instead of teaching the basics of serving, you can work more on strategy. Thanks for checking out this homework assignment from Get the Pancake. Make sure that you follow at Get the Pancake on Instagram and Facebook and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Just search for Get the Pancake and you'll find me.